in this video i am going to show you how to exclude items in a drop down list which are already selected once so i have three drop down lists here which shows a list of country names germany france uk india second list also shows the same list third list also shows the same list which are coming from countries sheet so the list is generated from here so if i select germany here let us see how the second list looks like so germany is missing here so because already selected so i have excluded germany in the third list also germany is not listed but it is listing from france uk so here if i select france let us see how the third list look like so the france is missing here so it's showing only from uk so i can select uk so let us learn how to exclude items in a drop down list so i have created a named range countries named countries so whose value is coming from here so this is a dynamic list which i have created using offset i have created another video on how to create a dynamic list you can refer to that so countries is the name of the list so here i am going to add the drop down list so clicking data go to data tools data validation data validation so i am changing from the drop down to list so here i am going to add the named range countries so that the drop down list will show germany france uk india etc so all the country names from that sheet will be displayed here so i am selecting germany from here so now i have to exclude germany in the second list so there is no list currently in cell b3 so cell b3 so i am going to create a list excluding germany from countries list so for that i am going to use the excel built in function filter so i am going to add a formula in cell c3 so using filter filter array is the list countries name range so countries and include so include countries not equal to germany so here i am doing absolute reference so closing the bracket filter so it will print the list of countries excluding what is printed in germany so you now germany is excluded so if i change the selection from germany to france france will be excluded and germany will be added so like that so i will change it back to germany so now it is printing vertically so i will enclose this function in a transpose function so that it is printed horizontally instead of vertically so the list of countries excluding germany is printed here using this formula so this is an array formula so this is an array so if i want to reference this entire array here suppose so i have to use a formula equal to reference the first cell of the array list use the absolute reference and then use a hash use a hash it will print the entire array here in the another cell so look at the formula c3 hash the first cell of the array and then a hash it will print the entire list so i am going to use the same formula in the drop down list which i am going to create in cell b3 so i'll go to data data validation uh, list so here i will click on this first cell with the filtered list and then use a hash to print the entire list so let us see how the drop down list looks see france uk etc see this is the list which i am displaying in the drop down list so here if i change it to france the drop down list will get germany added in the drop down list so it will show germany instead of france so i will put it back germany the value of germany so here see it displayed all country names from the countries list except germany so now i am going to select france from here so germany and france are already selected so i am going to copy this formula put it here so it will print the same result so so now here i have to display only countries excluding germany as well as france so i will make a slight change here so i will say i will copy this countries not equal to i will put a star and then paste it so countries not equal to b2 b2 means germany and countries not equal to b3 also b3 so that means countries not equal to b2 multiplied by countries not equal to. so this it will be the combined result of these two and it will show one country less so here the length is up to here here it is showing 
it is excluding france and germany so here the drop down list i am going to create saying list is equal to so this list and the hash and so it will show it will not show germany and france it will show from uk so i can select uk so let us look at the formula here so there are two formula country is not equal to b2 star country is not equal to b3 so star will act as an and and condition so the same thing i have to apply here so because we can't ensure that the users will fill the first drop down list so users may start from the third or second so here in this also we have to have two conditions so here it should exclude the countries listed in this drop down as well as the third drop down so i will copy this condition from here and paste it so country is not equal to b2 and country is not equal to b4 it is instead of b3 it will put b4 so france i am excluding so it will this list will not show germany and uk see there is no germany or uk in this list here also so uk is there in this list but uk is not there in this list because uk is already printed here so see here uk and germany are not there so so if i select france see here so in this list if i select na if i have already selected germany and uk in first and third list so germany and uk will not be available in this drop down list see so if i want to update germany here i have to go and remove this germany from here so then i will see germany here then i can put germany here and the same formula i have to update here also so here not equal to b3 b3 and not equal to b4 so here germany and uk it will exclude in this list and the drop down list formula i have to change data validation here instead of countries i have to use equal to this one hash so germany and uk will not be there in this list the germany and uk will not be. so i can only select countries other than germany or uk which is which are already selected in second and third drop down list so here i can select maybe belgium so if i select belgium if i want to change germany to belgium belgium is missing in this because belgium is already updated there so you will not see belgium in this list as well as in this list so so all three drop down list will exclude items in the other two lists so you can hide these items it is not good to show this so you select these cells go to home and show that in white color so you will not see those lists printed here see if i change it to france so here i can use belgium then here there is no france and belgium so i can select germany here That's it for now. Thanks for watching this video. Please click on like button if you find the information I shared useful and update comments. Also please subscribe to my channel to get notified about new videos which I will post in future.